It's another thing to have a decent looking resume. You need that and probably some references. But when it comes down to between choosing two candidates, the one with the certification, all the other things being equal, this is one very easy way to stand out. So my name is Rich Harrington, and I am going to talk to you about these exams. I've actually been an author for the exams in the past, so I've helped write the questions. So while I can't officially tell you what's on the exam, I can very much tell you about the exam and what you're going to need to know uh, as you take a look at it. So whether you're looking for a way to just challenge yourself or you want to improve your chances of getting hired or maybe a raise in pay, I recommend you consider taking the Adobe Certified Professional exams. Uh, they're a great way to really validate your skills and knowledge. And if you have these, it can provide you with a competitive edge, okay? So um, by the numbers here, these tests are designed by experts, theoretically. Uh, I've been in the room with some of the experts who've designed the test. I've helped design the test. I can tell you they are. It's a combination of formal educators and industry professionals. I've been one of those industry professionals. I've also seen other pros and there is a lot that goes into designing these test questions. 